Morning guys, welcome back to another vlog and today I'm going to Walsall versus Tramia Rovers. It's going to be a tough game today, Tramia sits second in the league, we've lost seven games in a row um, we're not full of confidence at the moment and Tramia, you know, doing well this season and it's going to be a really tough game, um, we need a win um, or just get any points on the board, I'd probably take a draw against a good Tramia side but a win would be much needed and um, would help us get out this mess really um, but yeah Matt Taylor got sacked on Wednesday I gave my thoughts um, in the video if you want to go and check that out but basically I just think it was probably the right decision Taylor wasn't getting the results but there's deeper problems at this football club you know there's some board members you know have been around since the bonds, sponsor days and they need to get rid of because of um, making this club rotten at the moment and Fullerton you know he doesn't help himself bringing in injured players and I know Devante Rodney's back in training, but he hasn't been fully fit since he's come in, and that's got to be questioned. But um, Mickey Flynn um, is um, favourite to take over from Matty Taylor at the moment. I think that'd be an excellent appointment. You know, he came into Newport um, a couple of seasons ago when they were in um, the same position as us, and he um, rebuilt them and made them climb up the league. It's going to be a tough game today. Um, I'd probably take a point, like I said, but on paper, Tranmere um, on better form. So um, I'm going to go over Walsall nil, Tranmere too. But you never know with football. Walsall might step up today. The players might show a bit of um, quality and a bit of fight to get the three points. But yeah, I'll see it at the ground. Come on, you saddlers. Brandon, before we go into today's game against Tranmere, what are your thoughts on Matt Taylor being sacked? Well, he's six or seven games now he's lost to. Uh, he's been made the scapegoat. But I think Max Saylor sacked him. I think Fullerton should go with him. He's the one who's brought all the players in and brought players in who ain't kicked the football yet. Mm -hmm. Signed people who, who ain't fit. How did he pass a medical? So I think Jamie Fullerton should have gone with him. So, yeah. But the board's assemble and the club is, so we'll have to wait and see. Uh, very poor performance on on Tuesday night against Cumbria. We couldn't beat ten men again, so yeah. So we'll see. Uh, Mickey Flynn is a favourite. Yeah, be a good appointment. Be a good appointment, but uh, is he going to work with Jamie Fullerton? We'll have to wait and see. What do you think for today's game against Today, Tramway? Well, today's game is going to be a very, a very, very hard game against Tramway. I'm not optimistic that we're going to get anything out of the game, but let's hope we can. Yeah. And uh, see what happens. A big process today, a big march from the railway pub to the Saddler's Ground. Yeah. Whether it'll do any good, I don't, I don't know. But the club's been worse. It's worse now than it was when it was under Bonsa. Yeah. It was bad enough with Bonsa, but it's even ten, ten times worse now under Pombling. No investment in the club, nothing. Just text the money and that's it. So yeah. we'll have to just wait and see. Well, let's hope they ring the manager in who can shake it up. But the players have got to take responsibility as well as the manager. But I think the stumbling block there is Jamie Fullerton. Until yeah. they get him out, I don't think we're going to do any good. So I'll just say, up the saddlers. Got a score prediction? Well, I hope we can win, but uh, I wouldn't back any money of it against I mean, Trambia's an high flying team. They're in this, the second from the top. Yeah. Um, I'd be happy if we could get a point. Yeah. But we've got tough games coming up. We've got Swindon, we've got Forest Green. You know, them games are going to be very tough. So, you know, we're only four points now from Aldermar. They've got a game in Anderwood. So, if we get beat today and Alden win, it's going to be one point. And they've got to say they've got the game in hand. So, Pompligan says last, last year that we don't want to be in this dog fight again. But where are we? We're in a worse position than we was last year. So. Let's, start, let's get the three points today. The three points, you saddlers, and get behind the team. Which the fans do get behind the team every week. It's yeah. the people who run the club who don't get behind the team. Yeah. Come on, you saddlers. <laughs>
I win at last. Come on. Guys, Warsaw get a massive three points at home. One they'll win over Tramia Rovers. You know, first win in 63 days. You know, we played much better under Neil McDonald. We looked more organised, there's more spirit. And that penalty from Wilson was well taken to get us the three points on the forest screen next Saturday. But you know, that's much better. And um, we might get a new manager in by then, a new permanent manager. Thank you guys for watching this vlog and up the saddlers.